Everybody loves sunglasses, but where the heck are you supposed to store them all? This sunglass rack will give you a place to store, organize, and display them so they're easy to access and nice to look at too. First of all, you're gonna wanna get on down to the hardware store and buy yourself some wood. Buy one board that's six feet long by five and a half inches wide, and two boards that are six feet long by two and a half inches wide. Both are three fourths of an inch deep. Next, have one of the friendly folks in the lumber department cut the boards for you. Cut the big board in half, and the small boards into five and a half inch pieces, the width of the big board. Have them cut until they can cut no more. That should give you 22 small wedges to put the sunglasses on. While you're shopping, make sure to pick up sandpaper, measuring tape and a pencil, wood stain if you so desire, and premium wiping cloths. These are used for staining, but we're gonna use them for something else as well. Then of course you'll need screws and something to attach the board to for easy hanging. As far as tools go, you'll need an electric screwdriver and a hammer. First step is sanding. Now, as you can see, those edges are pretty jagged. Nobody wants that. Start with the rough sandpaper and finish off with the smooth. If you're lucky enough to be able to borrow an electric sander from your brother-in-law, by all means, do it. It makes sanding 22 little blocks go by a lot quicker. But the sanding is more than worth it. Here are the first 11 blocks ready to go. The cool thing about these blocks is that they're exactly the right width as the height of the sunglasses. My boyfriend pointed that out as I was about to get into a serious geometrical equation. It is really as simple as just laying them out and tracing around them. Score! So I guess in actuality we can scratch the measuring tape off the list. <laughs> now that you know where everything goes, it's time to get it all screwed into place. Lay out your cloths to protect the floor and get out your screwdriver. Place the first board right under the mark and screw straight down. Now I somehow was able to pull this off, but on the second board there was a substantial gap and it just wouldn't squeeze together no matter how much I screwed. Enter the drill. I'd recommend you do this from the beginning. Drill the hole where the screw is going to go from the big piece of wood all the way through to the little one. And this should make it about 7,000 times easier. Another thing I found the cloths useful for was to fold them up under each piece I was working on to provide that pressure and keep it in place. Kind of like when you put a sugar packet underneath a table leg. You know what I mean? <laughs> Lastly, you're gonna hammer the little hook onto the back. Try to center it. After that, all you have to do is find a cool place to hang these babies up and you have your beautiful sunglass display. That's it.